Now, I've heard some crazy things over the years of playing Call of Duty. This one, though... <sighs> let's get some footage, and let's talk about it. So, I'm dropping a 35 for 9, and it's just a TDM game. I was I think I was kind of doing the double kills for the sniper rifle. And now, the big, I don't want to say conspiracy theory, because, to be fair, it actually sounds like something Activision would do. And this has also been a thing for years, though, now, where sometimes the game just feels a little bit off. Skill-based bullets. The algorithm is so advanced and so far ahead. Nice start there. I know, right, thanks. The, it can dictate the gunfight to do what it wants to do. So it can lower your damage, it can knock off your aim, it can basically choose whether you win or you lose and you have no or very little control whether that's going to happen or not. Do I think this is implemented into the game? What do I think it more likely is? Because I don't want to say no, to be honest with you, because it sounds like something Activision would do. Now, we've spoken about the matchmaking algorithm a lot on this channel, and you can, if you start to look into every individual gunfight that you get yourself into, one of my doubles, you would probably start to lose your mind when it comes to Call of Duty. I'm not joking, but this has been the situation for years. Now, I also saw the Jack Frags video where he said that the damage was off and he was getting one hit kills with a melee. And oh, he's on our team. I was like, how the hell did I miss that guy duck walking around? But he seemed to perceive that the, just the damage output was just off, or the, there's things that are going on in Modern Warfare right now that. You just aren't really making sense and that's kind of where i'm at with this as well but you have all we've all had moments and we've all done it i'm getting these doubles in dude we've all done it where we've had shots on somebody and they've just turned and you're dead you know out of nowhere it happens you think what the fuck was that you know, and you're just like, oh, it's an SMG, but on their screen, you're loading them full. But yeah, there's nothing, nothing, no red mark, nothing. You're just like you weren't there, you just saw one. Hi, do you want to be my friend? Oh, is that a gun barrel in my mouth? Why you hurt me, daddy? And that's what it feels like. And it does, it feels like this happens. A significant amount. I'm not saying it happened there, because I was just shit for a minute. You're all a shit. I know, right? You love it. You fucking love it, you dirty whores. But well, I'm kind of thinking this would make sense, but I don't see who it really benefits. Because the skill-based matchmaking in this game, and it is very strict. Obviously, we've spoken about multiple ways to get around it. Like I say, it's a strict system, but it's a flawed system. But having an algorithm dictate whether you win or lose a gunfight, regardless of what happens, I don't actually think that's quite the case. Although sometimes I do feel like it wants to stop you. Now, I do feel at times if you are getting ahead of yourself, then it wants to go, hold up a minute. You know, there's 11 other people in this lobby, dickhead. Calm it the fuck down. And it, there has been multiple times, like I've said before, where you've got shots on somebody and you know you've got shots on somebody and bullets come out of the side of the head. Hell, I even had it tonight when I was playing on Shipment. I was doing the Shipment 24-7, or when this video goes live last night or yesterday, but whatever. The, I was I was playing with my bromosexual life partner, Snicky, and I said to him, I was like, you just shot somebody and you were facing one way, the bullets came out of the side of your gun. He's like, oh fucking did they and you know it was kind of thinking well did the algorithm want him to win that gunfight the problem with this and this is where you throw all you know all what you like conspiracy theory activision doing this infinity ward bad you know the dictating everything you've got no control over it whatsoever if you enjoy call of duty right now like i do i enjoy modern warfare too it's buggy and broken as all hell but I'm making the best of it. And I, I am making the best of it. You know, I, I paid 70 quid for this. Twice. Because I got it on my Xbox and my PlayStation 5. And my son wanted it as well. And he is not old enough to work a full-time job yet. Then he's not old enough to be playing Call of Duty, is he? No, you're right. He's not. And call me whatever you want. But we have a damn good time when we're playing it, man. So, yeah. 
if I went into every death and I broke it down, and I've seen people doing this on Twitter, and you kind of like, obviously I've got an, I've got an opportunity here where you can record it and I put it into an editing software, and then I can break the footage down, and, and if I judge it frame by frame, then I would be able to tell whether or not something was going on, whether it was hit detection was playing up. In 2022, I mean, yes, internet and things can always happen, but that shouldn't really be happening. Or whether I snapped on lock to somebody and then all of a sudden my aim just randomly went off. I could check that. You know, I could see how many bullets I put into somebody compared to how many they put into me when I watched the kill cam. That is very doable. And it is all very doable. All of this is checkable and all of this you can go into deep research on and find out everything that you need to know. Our oh, Activision using bullets is a bullet-based matchmaking, not only skill-based matchmaking, it's been ramped up big time. Are oh, they doing this to us? I don't fucking care. That's the reality of it. You know what I hear when I hear this shit? Honestly, I don't like this game. You, you there, stop having fun. That's what I hear. It's Call of Duty. Fucking random shit happens. And everyone's saying this like this is a new thing. This is not a new thing. Did you not play Black Ops 2? You could be running up on somebody with a fucking the DSR. You have an MSMC. You can have the Remington. You can have whatever the fuck you wanted. But no, turn. Boom. Gone. Sniper, get down. No, I don't matter. It's too late. Sniper, get it, it, Honestly, it's fine, mate. He's already di I've died twice. Literally, they could just fucking throw their control across the room and get a quad feed. All right, you could fucking fart in the general postcode of your fucking controller and you'd get a super kill with that thing it was broken it was so broken how many times all right you just think back to black ops 2 everyone says black ops 2 is an amazing game yeah it's all right but snipers ruined it that dsr just fucking killed it that ballista don't even get me started on that shit now that was full of bullshit deaths but i don't see people coming out now saying well if we break down the algorithm and we talk about how many shots i got on dude it's been happening for fucking years it's call of duty it happens it's only because skill-based matchmaking is strict now that people are starting to find new reasons to get annoyed. I don't like skill-based matchmaking as it is right now. That's why I find ways to change it. And, you know, that, that's why I try to bend it to my very whim. And is there bully-based matchmaking? I don't fucking know. It's weird shit happens in Call of Duty all the time. From Modern Warfare 3, you now into Black Ops 2, into Ghosts. Uh, advanced Warfare, fucking hell, you want to talk about bullshit deaths? Advanced Warfare was the game! Super suits and you still get quick scoped in midair? Fuck off, man! As if that was ever happen! Bullshit and broken! So, something being broken and things being off and cool, it's not a new thing! I don't know whether it's just the Battle Royale guys because they're more competitive and they get really salty when they lose, but this is what happens when you don't have a, when you have a mode like that in Battle Royale and you don't have a respawn mode. If you had a respawn mode, say, like, fucking plunder, we wouldn't give a shit. Oh, we got sniped. Never mind. I haven't got to fucking wait to get into another lobby. I'm oh, sorry. I have to go to a gulag, then get in another lobby, then spawn back in, then drop back down, then pick up a load of shit, only get shot from three days away. Because you're spending too much time in the fucking menus, it's making you think. It's making you think, oh, I wonder if Activision are fucking with me. Or did hit detection not go my way? I'm a bit of a salty bitch. I've got to wait forever to get a new game now. I don't fucking know, dude. I know chances are the algorithm may be fucking with you for all I know. Do I care, though? Not particularly, dude. Is that because it's not my problem when I play multiplayer and whether I do well or whether I do shit, I enjoy myself because, you know, I play games for fun? Maybe, but I'm just another filthy fucking casual.